Zarin has set a trap for us. The stalwart is surrounded on all sides, and we cannot hyper to safety because of their interdictor cruiser. All fighters will be deployed immediately. You must take out the interdictor before it's too late. Our regular TIE squadrons are at half strength, and we only have two TIE defenders and one TIE advanced craft left on board from our previous engagements. If we fail, we will not only lose the Magpulse technology, but more importantly, our commander, Vice Admiral Thrawn. We cannot count on our forces to arrive in time to save us. Our survival is now up to you. Once again, Zarin has discovered our plans, but there is no time to find the Security League now. He has followed our efforts to gain the Magpulse technology and has sprung a trap, surrounding the stalwart while an interdictor cruiser prevents our escape. We have also confirmed that the ZA-13 facilities were destroyed along with our forces there, so we cannot rely on any reinforcements. We are on our own. Until the interdictor is destroyed, the stalwart will not be able to hyperspace to safety. With our TIE squadrons at half strength, only two TIE defenders and a single TIE advance left to defend her, we must use every weapon at our disposal. As such, you will be armed with the new Magpulse warheads we captured in the previous mission. This warhead incapacitates its target by disabling its weapon systems temporarily. You will use them on the enemy capital ships to render their defenses inoperable until the stalwart can destroy them with her turbo lasers. Then we can take out the interdictor and escape before more of Zarin's ships arrive to finish the job. Be careful though, the Magpulse will only disable their systems for a brief time, so keep a close eye on the enemy capitals. You only need to use one warhead per ship. Expect to also face Thai starfighters flown by Zarin's best pilots.
With the help of your heroic efforts and the timely arrival of the Nebulon B Frigate Thrasher, thought lost at ZA-13, our remaining forces made it out of there alive, and we eliminated several of Zarin's own capital ships in the process. 
Vice Admiral Thrawn sends his personal congratulations and wishes that you join him in his efforts to track Zarin down. The Emperor has commanded Admiral Thrawn to destroy Zarin's forces and has made available to him the best resources in the Imperial Navy in order to accomplish this. You are one of these resources.